<laughs> what are you guys doing? I'm gonna go over the rules one more time. Rule number one, you do not talk about Fight Club. Rule number two, you do not talk about Fight Club. But seeing as how you're all so tech savvy, yes, I've had to create a social media policy for Fight Club. <laughs> so put away your phones, because rule number three, you do not post on Facebook about Fight Club. And if you see a post on Facebook about Fight Club, you do not like a post on Facebook about Fight Club. <laughs> rule number four, you do not tweet about Fight Club. And you definitely do not end that tweet, hashtag Fight Club. <laughs> so whoever at Fight Club guy is, please stop tweeting, OMG, I love Fight Club. <laughs> DM me for deets, it's not against the rules, hashtag Fight Club. <laughs> You're getting followers, man, it's bad for us, okay? Do you guys not see how this is bad for Fight Club? <laughs> Fight Club is not CrossFit, all right? We're not CrossFit, we don't need to be on Instagram. Look at my Instagram feed right now, okay? Look at this. Picture of Fight Club, picture of Fight Club, picture of weird fruit. <laughs> picture of Fight Club. Rule number five, do not post pictures on Instagram of Fight Club. Rule number six, no filters on Instagram. <laughs> Rule number seven, anyone taps out or goes limp, fight's over, gentlemen. <laughs> and I don't want to see it on YouTube the next day, guys. There's no such thing as a Fight Club fail. Nobody gets pwned at Fight Club. Rule number eight, it's my favorite rule. It's your first night at Fight Club. You have to fight. And that used to be where the rules stopped, guys. Rule number nine, there's no Groupons for Fight Club. <laughs> Especially no Groupons for one free night of Fight Club where you don't have to fight. <laughs> rule number 10, no Snapchat. Rule number 11, no Slapchat, which apparently is an app where you can have Fight Club anywhere. <laughs> and that's it, that's the end of the rules. Any questions? Pinterest? Fight Club's over, guys. <laughs> Dear Lutron Lighting Solutions, I have a little complaint about your environmentally friendly, friendly automatic light switches. Uh, nah. <laughs> While I don't usually write emails like this one, I think it necessary. <laughs> Sorry, that you know that I am not satisfied as a consumer. You see, I'm sitting in my office right now, and your product it doesn't seem to acknowledge that I'm in here. Or that I even exist, which I do, and I don't appreciate it when my inanimate objects don't admit that I exist. Now, I'm all for saving the environment. Burn, mother. <laughs> And I'm not asking for a refund or anything, but what I would like is for you to tell me that I exist! I'm in here! Turn it on! Am I a ghost? Am I a ghost? Is that what you think? I'm, I'm here! Turn it on! Oh. Yours, yours sincerely, nobody. <laughs> who died exploring the Antarctic. And I click enter, and if I match with someone, Bowtie Needs Binoculars just sends a text message to a telegraph operator who sends a carrier falcon right to my match's front door. Look, a match! Ooh, her name's Coriander, perfect. Ooh, and she lives in a treehouse boat. That's a treehouse, that's on a boat. Gosh, she seems so great. Well, I hope that carrier falcon doesn't mind carrying a picture of my penis. <laughs>
Uh, mohalo. Um, <laughs> uh, or aloha means never having to say you're sorry. Uh, or uh, the only pop punk emo band out of Honolulu, and this is their song. Oh, oh. That shit! <laughs> because I live in Hawaii and it makes me cry. Every day here is perfect with the clear blue sky. Every day I go surfing and I hope I die. And that's just life when you're living in Hawaii. friend's a dolphin, and he hates my dad, and the fish always singing, and it hurts my head, and the girls are so gorgeous, and they love to fuck, and that just sucks, cause I'm living in Hawaii. <laughs> I hate that every time I have a drink, it's gotta be out of a coconut with a little umbrella in it. And you know what I hate? I hate that every time I have sex, it's gotta be on the beach at sunset. And you know what I hate? I hate that I'm so goddamn chill. I don't have any cares. I don't have any worries. God! And you know what I really hate? I hate that my dad, he bought me a ukulele instead of an electric guitar. But that's just life when you're living in <laughs> 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 <laughs>